Hello everyone, this is Trestle242 and in this video I thought we could do a random genetics challenge using the new story mode introduced in The Sims 4. By the way, I'm using a mode that makes this screen purple. But if you click here, add a sim, then you can click add a sim via story, which I'm going to do. Let's start with an easy question. What age am I? Let's do uh, adult. The best part of bowling with friends is... Strike! Bowling team shirts, so or the bowl of ships. The bowl of chips. Well, let's see. The best part is strike, of course, winning at bowling. A friend trips and falls in my home. What's my reaction? Did they. I'll provide first aid. Did they break anything? Point and laugh. Well, did they break anything? Someone ate. Someone ate the last slice of my pizza. I'll treat everyone as a suspect. I've just met someone new. To impress them, I'll prank them, try my best pickup line, or brag about my collections. Uh, brag about my collections, I guess. I have a great idea for a prank. It's at someone else's expense. It's self-deprecating. I would never prank anyone. It's at someone else's expense. I found an uneaten sandwich, but I don't know whose it is. I'll get it. What do I save money for? A better home? The future? Nothing. I live in the moment. Maybe the future? There's a going away party for an acquaintance. What do I do? Bake them a pie, buy them a gift, or send a text message? Well, it's just an acquaintance. I guess I could bake a pie. I mean, that sounds nice. It's open mic night at the bar. Well, open mic, sorry. Um, then I'm up telling my best jokes, doing slapstick comedy, or showing off my musical talent. Um, I think for this sim, maybe slapstick comedy. A lot of questions about jokes. Someone makes a joke about me, how do I react? I yell at them, I laugh and play along, I feel humiliated. I laugh and play along. Now we have this weird sin with a bright yellow enormous hat. Hey, nice to meet you. Feel free to assign my gender, adjust my appearance, and select my clothing. And don't forget to give me a name. Okay. Career in entertaining, good at bowling and comedy, and wants to make enemies and become a famous criminal. But she's cheerful, a glutton, and a goofball. And the name is 123 Susan123. Susan Denny, okay. Since she's got a hat, let's randomize the hat. 123. Oh no, she got the elf hat. Oh no. Well, let's start with randomizing the face three times. I mean, she's got a really cute face now, actually. But let's do it. One, two, three. Okay. You can really see how ashy the EA skin tones look when compared to this, which is the Melanin Pack by X Mira Mira. Now, would you please stand still? Let's see, can I randomize skin details? No, okay, that's a big shame. I can randomize the teeth, let's do that. One, two, three. Okay, so she's got some gold teeth in. Brow scars, I can randomize the scars, but not... Well, let's just... no scars for the moment. Okay. Let's do the whole head shape. I have a mod which adds more presets, based on all the NPCs in the game, which is why you see like five bazillion different one of these. One, two, three. Okay, and the eyebrows. One, two, three. Really thin eyebrows, okay. Eyes. One, two, three. Okay, so those big blue eyes. 
and the notes. One, two, three. Okay. And mouth. One, two, three. Very small mouth. She's got a kind of unusual look to be sure. One, two, three. Cheeks. One, two, three. Jawline. One, two, three. Yeah, she went from being really pretty to looking like I don't even know. I think it's that her mouth is so small. And as you can see, there are so many types of ears that the game hasn't even got time to load them in. One, two, three. And since she's, since she's already got a uh, full body outfit, that's what I'm going to give her. Let's do her body type. One, two, three. Okay, oh wow, yeah, she's got uh, quite a bit of a bust going on. And now let's give her a full bodied outfit. One, two, three. Okay, the elf hat really ruins everything about this. One, two, three. Okay, and little cat, red cat shoes. I will just delete this sim. She's one of the sims you can get from the uh, beginning when you start making a new household and she's also one of the sims from the new sims cover. I forget her name but I kind of like her, I think she's cute. And I really love the island living music. Now let's create the other sim, also an adult. And what kind of home do I want to live in? A big luxurious house, sounds nice. I've just met someone new. To impress them I will prank them, try my, try my best pickup line, I think. I've got a pile of documents stacking up, what do I do? Sort them out, shred the rest, combine them with another pile, bury them in a time capsule. Just combine them with another pile, what could go wrong? What do I most want to do on a trip to Selva Dorada? Mingle with the locals, venture into the jungle, or explore ancient ruins. Mingle with the locals, maybe. I found an ancient relic of some kind. Sell it. If I could be remembered for one thing, what would it be? All the art I've made, my contributions to science, for everything I've collected. Um, for everything I've collected, maybe. What's the best music to dance to? High energy, hopping music. I make my own jams. Slow music, make it romantic. Yeah, I make my own jams. That sounds good. It's time to hit the nightclub and dance the night away. Scope out the DJ or hang with my friends. Just hang with my friends. What approach do I take to my job? It's a means to an end. Success is important to me. I trust in my awesomeness. I trust in my awesomeness. What kind of group would I do I want to be a part of? The kind that better society, me and my imaginary friends, I lead, others follow. Well, I guess the kind of the better society. We have this fella, who is a romantic. He's unemployed, but he's good at silver rod and culture and charisma. And he's got high starting funds, nice. But he's good, self-assured, and, materiali and materialistic. His name is Casey. Casey Donovan. And currently he has got kind of a weird look going on. Wait, I forgot to change her hair, I just realized. One, two, three. Grey hair. Let's actually remove the hat. I, the hat is, is key is just bothering me. Okay, that's super cute. She looks well. She looks super weird. And let's just check. Can I randomize makeup? No. Oh, why not? And why can't I randomize accessories? Oh, that's annoying. Let's start with his face. One, 
two, three. Okay. Again, this is a pretty alright looking face. Eyes, one, two, three. Okay, blue eyes again. Eyebrows, one, two, three. Uh, not, not so bad, not so bad. Nose, this can really sort of make or break a face, I find. One, two, three. Yeah, they both got those sort of downwards pointing noses, I've noticed. Cheeks, one, two, three. I didn't see much of a difference there, but whatever. Your one, two, three. Okay, I saw a big difference there. <laughs> Mouth, one, two, three. Both have these tiny lips, ears. One, two, three. Yeah, he's definitely got a sort of weak jaw going on here. Quite a big overbite, it looks like. Okay, let's give him a new hairstyle. One, two, three. And he's also got grey hair, that's so weird. Let's do something about the facial hair. One, two, three. Okay, some stubble. He looks kind of weird. Let's change his body. One, two, three. Okay, he's got kind of a normal body going on. And let's give him some new clothes. One, two, three. Uh, okay. One, two, three. Got some shorts. Um, maybe something different other than the boots. One, two. Three, uh, okay, I mean... Sure, Casey Donovan. I hope the kids have white hairs too, that would be kind of interesting. Well, white, I guess, silverish grey. Now let's play with the genetics. No, sh Gilan, we both. And let's do a teenage son and randomize it three times. One. What? Two. Three. Uh, where does that dark? Well, I guess it comes from Susan. Okay, this is a really interesting looking kid. And honestly, I kind of. I don't think there's much to add. I mean, I, I like this look. I guess the one thing I would change is maybe the shorts. They're a bit weird. But, I mean, I guess that could be a statement of personal style, a sort of contrasting deal going on. He looks really interesting. I mean, this is the kind of face I would not make myself in, in creative sim. And I guess the purple boots, they also add contrast. And let's give him a, some sort of random aspiration. There were no questions about children, so I'm guessing that... I mean, since his mother wants to be a master criminal, and his father is romantic, I'm guessing maybe something... like... Chief of Mischief? It is all about the pranks. And since his mother is cheerful eh? and his father is good, then maybe he's cheerful as well. <laughs> oh, skimbo. And then something like, I don't know. Wait, I can randomize them. Okay, good. Okay, so he's a bro and a bookworm. That's 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 definitely something unusual. Now let's make a sister for him. Oh. I'd have to do it like this, I see. Okay, let's create the daughter. One. Two. Three. 
to 3. Wow, she has got a sense of style. I mean, again, honestly, I don't hate this. I think this is a look and a half. Like, look at that. This is just... Yeah. It's not a very teenage look. Like, she looks way too mature. But I think maybe that's the grey hair speaking. And she's a slob. And outgoing. An outgoing slob. Maybe uh, popularity then. Maybe leader of the pack. She wants to be the leader of the best club in town. Or she wants to be a celebrity. Let's give her a name. Emily. And let's give uh, the brother a name. Manu Donovan. And Emily Denny. It's weird that they don't have the... But I guess since the parents aren't married. And don't have the same last name. Never mind. Okay, this was a really short random genetics <laughs> video. Since I honestly... I don't want to change it. I think this is a really cool and interesting look. Oh. I mean, even the earrings that kind of contrast a lot. Yeah, go for it, you know. And I think his look is really good too. I think the colors just look really good against his skin tone. And the one weird thing is the boots, but I like the purple color of the boots. So yeah, this was my really short little random genetics challenge. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this, and I will see you guys soon. Thank you, you've been watching Trestle242. Have a wonderful day now. Bye bye! Sul sul!